Yeah. I'm Levin Reed, and if you want to go to the Olympics, you have to start early. How about figure skating couples age eight? That story ahead on Nine News Now. <laughs> Oh, man, usually sports is about big hulking guys with, you know, steroids and all that. We got none of that. <laughs> no, I, but I want you to take out your cute meter and tell me if this story doesn't register at least right. 10 on the uh, cute scale. Please take Brian Boitano, Christy Yamaguchi, Michelle Kwan, Sarah Hughes, Oksana Bayul, Michael Weiss, and stick all of them in a really hot clothes dryer until they shrink down to one-third of their original size. What you get when they come out is the Wheaton Ice Skating Academy. Here's Levin Reed. They glide across the ice to songs that were produced before they were born. Say your age for me. Eight. And you? Ten. These so-called tiny ice dancers have been lacing up the skates and cutting an ice rug since before they were in kindergarten. The moves can become complex. Sometimes I think, oh no, this move's so hard, I'm gonna fall. And then... You just do it like, whew, like that. But practice has them all performing big. The partners execute routines that help them become victorious over ice dancers twice their age. Communication on the ice is a major part of their success. We're like constantly talking to each other just to like make sure the other one knows what they're doing. The orchestrator of this ICE program is excellent. Alexei Kilyakov. Good job, excellent. He decided to take individual All skaters right, so and pair them up to okay. maximize their talents. The idea worked. His skaters took home medals at the Lake Placid Ice Dance Championships. It takes a uh, feeling of each other. When you skate, you cannot even look to your partner and already say your partner lift right hand up. So it's, it takes time, it takes experience. Now at the end of the day, it's all about performance. Can you get it done when the lights are on during the competition? As you know, young kids can be notoriously nervous. So from group to group, the confidence is at a different level. When I get on the ice and I see everybody, um, it starts getting me really nervous. It's like, I'm gonna fall over, oh no, oh no. It's a little scary when you begin, but then once you, um, you uh, get out there, you see everybody smiling, and then you think of yourself smiling, and it becomes really fun and it's not scary anymore. Dancing and skating before you can walk. That's a miracle on ice. With the Wheaton Ice Skating Academy, I'm Levin Reed, 9 Sports Now. But, but so here's the thing. Here's Jen Ryan, typical mom. She watches the story and goes, <laughs> I, I wouldn't want my 8-year-old girl being carried above the ice by an 8-year-old boy because she's going to get dropped on her head. Like, put a helmet on. But they're very talented. They're, and so they're terrific. You have nothing to worry about, Mom. Okay. Okay? Sure. We'll get him a helmet. <laughs> <laughs> Brett, thank you, sir. Thank